next. Yeah, yeah, we up next. Man, I swear that we up next. For the past several months, I've heard nothing but complaints from the Raw superstars and fans about the way Eric Bischoff has vacated damn near every title on Raw. So, Eric, I'm giving you a chance to come on out to this very ring right now and explain your actions. stand on dangerous ground here tonight so what do you have to say for yourself well mr. McMahon as everyone knows I used to be in charge of WCW the most dominant force in the sports entertainment industry what was it 88 weeks in a row that we beat this very show in the ratings 88 straight weeks yeah and we all know how that turned out I used to be the undisputed king of sports entertainment. I take exception to that. And now look at me. I became nothing more than a lackey. Under the thumb of WWE Board of Directors and the almighty Vince McMahon. Well, I'm sick of it. I've been sick of it for a long time. And about six months ago, I decided to do something about it. I was approached by someone who promised me enough financial backing to raise a new sports entertainment empire that would rival the mighty WWE. In exchange for his support, all I had to do was handicap Raw in any way I could, while at the same time, lend my genius to this new venture. Genius. So I stripped the Raw superstars of their titles and put them in the most grueling matches conceivable. And all the while, my partner was making deals and targeting the WWE for a hostile takeover. Now you're probably wondering why I've chosen to reveal this master plan tonight. Well, quite frankly, it's so close to fruition that not even the great Vince McMahon can stop us now. So it is my great pleasure to introduce you to my partner. He is a true titan of business and sports entertainment. Save it! It's JBL, right? What? John Bradshaw Layfield, the WWE Champion. That's your partner, am I right? Mr. McMahon's one step ahead of Bishop. You see, I've known about your pathetic little scheme for a month, Eric. Did you seriously think you could just start vacating Raw titles without me taking an interest in why you were doing it? I think Mr. McMahon may be miles ahead of Bishop. I've already contacted SmackDown General Manager Theodore Long, and although JBL doesn't even know it yet, this titan of business and sports entertainment, as you call him, has been stripped of his WWE title and fired from SmackDown. I know JBL's on his way here, and I also knew you two had planned some dramatic unveiling for your so-called master plan. Well, JBL's gonna get a bit more drama than he bargained for when he arrives here tonight. You see, I've got someone waiting for JBL in the parking lot. The man who won an opportunity to challenge Triple H for the World Heavyweight title at WrestleMania. Raw's number one contender is going to meet JBL in the parking lot? What does that mean, JR? I don't think he's there to roll out the red carpet, King. I thought it might be a good warm-up for Raw's title contender to take on a world champion before WrestleMania. So when JBL shows up here tonight, he's going to find himself in a parking lot brawl. And by my watch, JBL should be arriving right about now. You, you, you can't be serious. 
You, you can't do this to me. I'm Eric Bischoff. I, I, I'm the general manager of Raw. I, I, I'm the only man to take on Vince McMahon and, and win. Eric, in case you haven't figured it out by now, the only thing you are is your fire. And a minute too soon. Thank you, Mr. McMahon. But that's not all. There's going to be a parking lot brawl between JBL and Raw's number one contender. JBL may be a true titan of business, but he's about to find out what happens when he sticks his 10-gallon head into Raw's business. And there isn't a damn thing Bischoff can do about it anymore. So we start things backstage, huh? JBL. Oh, you like this limbo? This limo yours? Is the limo yours? Boy, I said it wasn't yours. Huh? Oh, shit! Time to put that boy head through the window. Is he all right? I don't care if he's all right. Get his ass up. Motherfucker. Huh? 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 Oh, wee! No, I ain't done with you. Get your head in there. Get your head in there. Can I? Oh, I was gonna try to slam the hood. I don't know if I can, but let me let me try one more time. Let me try one more time. One more time. Oh shit! Oh, they had shit like this in the video game. Oh, flash! Oh my god! Watch out, real, real. You in my way. How you gonna disqualify me backstage? Oh, Dookie Draws have an ass motherfucker. Oh, you wanna move, huh? You wanna move, huh? Oh, shit. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, man. No. Oh, he done got me on the SUV. Oh, <laughs> we got the. Oh, oh, you got to let me up. Oh, you can't see me. I'm John Cena. Oh, okay, okay, JBL. Okay, okay. You got it. You got it. What you want? Some champagne? Oh. Uh, oh, no. No, to the back of the head. I got to get up. Motherfucker. Motherfucker beating the living hell out of me. This shit supposed to be scripted. They said I was winning this shit. And you back here beat my ass. What are you mad for? You're gonna put your head through the window so you're mad, huh? Get up. Boy. You shouldn't have got up. Uh-oh. Got him in there. Oh! Oh, concrete. That ain't nothing but concrete, y'all. Yeah. Uh-uh. DDT, oh my goodness, he's gonna be out for months. This man is done, done. Done, put that boy's skull to the concrete. Now get up. Uh-oh. Hit him with the F, you, cause fuck you, JBL. No, not over with. I'm a, uh, 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 come on, man. Let me get the fucking reverse. And you pin, or is it knockouts? I don't know what it is, but I'm pumping that boy in the air. Oh, big pause, big pause. No. Here we go. One, One two, two, three. Oh. Oof. Here's your winner, John Cena. Damn right, it's John Cena. The window's still out, guys. That's pretty dope. This is back in fucking 2005.
shed a tear for either of them, JR. But what's Raw gonna do now that our general manager has been fired? Last week, on behalf of all the Raw superstars, I taught SmackDown a lesson about what happens when you try to mess with the dominant brand of sports entertainment. And Vince McMahon gave me his personal assurance that there will be no more interference from SmackDown until after WrestleMania, which is just how I want it. I've shed blood, sweat, and tears to get where I am today. The World Heavyweight title is the crown jewel in our business. And it brings out the best in every superstar that comes near it. Eric Bischoff could never understand that. And that's one reason why he's the ex-general manager of Raw. Amen to that. disagree with this joker about damn near everything so i'm as shocked as anyone else to realize that we're on the same page this time this is the crown jewel of our business this is the ultimate prize it's the last thing on every superstar's mind when they go to sleep at night and the first thing on their mind when they wake up I have to admit he's right, King. If the World Heavyweight title isn't on your mind, you're in the wrong business. And the single ultimate reason this title means so much is because it's around the waist of me. The game. Every loser in the back thinks that if he can wear this title, he might one day be good enough to be mentioned in the same breath as Triple H. Imagine that, JR. Who wouldn't want to be mentioned alongside an all-time great like Triple H? Oh, please. But listen to me very carefully. This title is a part of me, and I am a part of it. Without the title, my life has no meaning. Without me, this title is just a belt. Yeah. You may have your opportunity against me at WrestleMania, but you'll never beat me for this title. Mm. You'll never take away that part of me. So take a good look now, because this is the closest you will ever come to it as long as I'm around. And why? Because I'm that damn good my drop oh no nah! broke my jaw what a noble champion i tell you what triple h makes me sick he just won the title and i already can't wait to see somebody take it away from him damn it we've only been without a general manager for a week and already raw is turning into a madhouse There's a hurricane coming through. Come on, man. What you gonna do? Uh oh. Bad match. <laughs> well, look who it is. It's the great green tomato. What's up? Kid. Now listen up, you dastardly villains. 
The Hurricane is here to bring you to justice and truth, honor, and integrity to the World Heavyweight Championship. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? And how are you going to do that exactly? By relieving you of that title, of course. With justice on my side and my hero powers at my disposal, an evildoer like you doesn't stand a chance. Kid's got a lot of heart. <laughs> yeah, but it's not pumping any blood to his brain. Got those my skills. <laughs> Hold on a second. You want a world heavyweight title match? You against me <laughs> for this? Man, I, I I don't think I'm ready to take on a superhero tonight. At least not by myself. Tell you what. How about you and your sidekick there take on me and Ric Flair? Right here, right now. Surely you are familiar with the concept of a superhero team up, citizen contender. For one night only, I will take you on as my her sidekick and join forces with you to defeat Triple H's evil schemes. The battle is joined. They just threw my ass in a match. Damn, they ain't even ask me if I want to even be in the match. Hey, come on, Ma. I wasn't trying to be in no match. I'm trying to skip all the way to WrestleMania. Shit. I want the World Heavyweight Championship. Get up. I've got a feeling that this has oh, all fuck. the making of himself Hurricane. That's probably just gas, JR. <laughs> Well, I have a I name in that. Oklahoma barbecue before tonight's show, but I don't think that's it. Here. There we go. Whoop his ass! Think he a, a hero? What a counter! Let's see what he can do in the ring. Oh no! Boy, you putting your hands on me? I wonder how long these superstars will be able to keep this up. There we go. They'll go as long as they need to, King. And if they can't, they won't be having their arms raised. Hey, he holding it up. That's for damn sure. He's holding up. This could be a pinfall. Uh oh. Not even a count. A reversal. Can he capitalize on it? Caught that boy. Oh, the right hits. Whooping his ass. Okay. Old man, this old man, man Flair, old man Flair in trouble. Old man Rip Flair is in trouble. Of these superstars, that's not going to be easy. That's for sure. No one in this match is going down without a fight, and I wouldn't expect. Damn! Smacked him on the back of his head. Like him or not, you've got to respect the tenacity of each and every WWE superstar. Swip into that corner. Rip Flair is in trouble. The Hurricane. No, you don't, boy. Don't come over here. You think these fans have gotten their money's worth tonight, Jr.? If they haven't yet, stand I'm back. Sure going There's to a Hurricane coming. Well, through. I don't say this too often, but I completely agree with you. Two, three. Double team in so that boy. going to win this match, Jr.? Four. I'm not even going to hazard a guess, King. These superstars are so unpredictable that that would be just about the most foolish thing I could possibly do. Did you see that? Ring the damn bell! You can't let somebody get away with that. I don't think the ref saw damn. it. Damn! The the well, fucking see him up now. It's not illegal. Uh oh. Uh oh. Boy, this yeah, I'm from behind. In all of WWE. Oh, come on, JR. oh shit. Here he come. I know it. Here he all come. No. No, it's a hurricane. He's all fired Hurricane's now. not going to slow and down. No, you don't. Not over here, my boy. Get your ass back in that ring. That boy tried to tag. You see, he got the ring that... The ring, the, the button to get out the ring, it's a tie button. Remind me to never try and step between these guys, JR. <laughs> Boy, you better get your head back in that ring. Sure. Fight that old man. Shit. Three. Ain't nothing but an old ass man anyway. Four. The 
submission has been expertly applied, and now it's just got him into the sleeper. JR, you've either got to break the hold or get broken by it. He's got the lead. Oh, no, this before. No, JR, he's got that figure four locked in. The figure four leg lock on my partner. Oh. Oh! And there he goes. Oh! The is locked in. Still an extreme. Beating that boy's ass got him up top. Go either way. You know, JR, it's obvious that gonna drop him oh my goodness. Or jumping to conclusion. What a soup like off the top well, rope. Man, Both I men are down. Either, King. You're looking pretty fit though, I must say. What is Triple H waiting on? What should have just went for some sort of the pen? Then how did he get his powers? But well, here we go. He dropped on his head one here we go. He was playing possum, and his opponent fell. Oh, he rolled that one boy up. Sinker. One. There's no way that was going to be a three count. Uh oh. They double teaming my boy. Oh no. Uh oh. Everybody in this arena. The pedigree. Oh, caught that boy in the nuts. I can't believe he counted that one. I don't know how he counted that one. It looks like they've slowed the match down a little. Uh oh, Triple H up high with an elbow drop. I'm sure they're well acquainted with the old expression, fools rush in. Is that why you But he ain't done with him. I think I've eaten a little too much good Oklahoma barbecue in my day, King. To hurry anyway. Need a face. Busted wide open. Busted wide crazy. open. I don't know what's so great about watching a human being brutalized like this. Oh shit. Come on, JR. Hurricane in a lot of trouble. What a DDT. He's gonna roll him over finally. For the one, two, three. Well, there it is. That's the match. Here are your winners. Damn, we lost.